Hello everybody, this is T.W. Jordo from technoforum.net. What I want to do is uh, go over the Uberizer with you today. Uh, you see here, this is the Uberizer. And click that link there. You go right here to downloads. And then this is the latest one. It's Uberizer version 1.2 was uh, released to public on uh, December the 1st, uh, 2012. You can click this link here. And uh, here's what it will look like. A bunch of useful information here on the forum. A bunch of, uh, bunch of instruction on how to properly use it and how to set it up. The download link is uh, for Mediafire. So whenever you download from Mediafire and you get uh, get to where you're ready to open it up, and you will get an icon on your desktop or wherever you save it to, we'll have this icon here. So for the setup, you simply uh, right click on that. We're going to run it as administrator, and yes, <clears throat> this is an Uberizer setup wizard. You click next. Uh, the license agreement here from uh, HCH to you, the user. This is not to be uh, redistributed or uh, copied in any way or posted on any other forum. It is the express property of Hardcore Hacker and not to be duplicated without his permission. Or you will be banned from the forum. So you can click I accept the agreement. It's better to read all of it. I've done read it a few times. And uh, ask you where you would like to install it. C program files, x86, technoform.net, Uberizer. Uh, click next, click next. We'll continue on through that. Uh, I already have it installed, so I will show you uh, how to use it. So whenever you finish installing it, it will bring up this shortcut here. You can see it's the shortcut for the Uberizer. So before you even run that, it's best to go ahead and have your device. Now here I have an Eakin T01A that uh, it's not rooted or anything. This is a factory ROM on it. It's like out of box. This is my guinea pig Frankenstein unit. You can see there's lines in the screen. Uh, I've done a lot of testing with this model here. Uh, it's a very good device, but uh, I'll show you how to uh, to root it, to uh, customize the the build prop on it for full market access, and also uh, most importantly, before you do any of that, is to back it up with the Uberizer. So you want to connect it here with a USB device to the computer, and then the shortcut for Uberizer. We're going to right click on it and then I'm running Windows 7 64 bit version so I'm going to uh, run as administrator and then uh, we'll click yes. Okay I want to show you how to use this <coughs> the Uberizer here. What we're going to do first off is uh, the backup be option D. And option zero will be a full device backup. Okay, let's see if it actually saved it. And go to a uh, computer into your hard drive on mine it's program files x86 and technoform.net uberizer and backups 12 9 12 3 17 p.m. 
see here 318 so there is my most current backup okay so now let's uh, we have it backed up so let's proceed to routing option C is routing And this device is a Ekin T01A A10. On the menu here, we have option six, which is uh, tested on A13s. It also works on the A10. So we're going to input six. Okay, that's done. Okay. So we are next going to do some uh, build prop mods. Let's see here. Option B is the build menu. Okay. Auto mod, edit mod. You got your market mod, and then your backup and also a restore. Uh, we're going to do the market, which would be option three. Please re reboot your device manually or using option R in the main menu. Press any key to continue. So let's press a key here and then we are going to hit R. If you see here, R is reboot. So I'll put R there and we can. The device is rebooting. Okay, still detected the model. I'll show you here a couple other things that we can do. There's a whole firmware menu here. There's option I. So this can be used for backing up. It's your image unpacker, the image packer. You can dump all the firmware. You can restore the firmware from ROM dumps. And you can start live suit right here all within the Uberizer. But I'm going to hit quit, which takes me back to the main menu. You can always use Q to return to the main menu. And if you're in this main menu and you hit Q, then it will quit and uh, take you out of the Uberizer. The uh, other thing to show you here is uh, there's all kinds of app management that you can do here. You can transfer applications uh, from your computer to your device here with option G. Option G is application manager. You can batch install apps and uh, you can back up the system apps, you can back up the data apps, you can restore ones that you've already backed up. There's, uh, there's all kinds of things you can do here with the Uberizer. And it is very quick. It doesn't take but a second to actually do the process and procedure. Okay, one other thing here for the root menu. It's option C. And uh, option 13, check root on device. Okay. Okay, here you can see that uh, it is successfully installed it. We can check over here on the device. It's already opened it up. Shows the device as a T01A.
busy box has been installed correctly verify root congratulations you have root access all that was done here with the uberizer so check us out at www.technoforum.net and uh, come get you some of this